What's going on everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Ashner. So last episode we started digging our hole to the core. We made it to the core. Not exactly the way we planned. Look at this plant. This is a thwomper plant. How close can we get? Ah, you can't catch me! <laughs> oh, he caught me. Never mind, just kidding! Don't die! Don't die! Don't die! <laughs> great way, great way to start an episode. Um, but yeah. So last time, in the last episode, we dug to the core of the planet, we powered the purple thing, and we need graphene. We need graphene in order to get this engine up and running. So our goal this episode is going to be to get the engine up and running. And then, probably move on to another planet. So we did some base building stuff. Uh, we had a good time. It was fun, but I we need to progress. We got more. We got a lot more to do here. Uh, not necessarily on this planet, but we got a lot more to do in the game. We can't just hang out at one planet the whole time. I mean, come on. You you can't. You just don't hang out at one planet the whole time. Absolutely not. So, our plan: activate the core, go to the satellite, throw on the uh, the ring that we have. Or throw on the, what do you even call that, artifact? Maybe it's an artifact, it's an artifact. We'll go with the artifact. Throw the artifact on, and then uh, move on to another planet. I think we'll probably end up going to wherever we decide to later in the episode. <laughs> I don't wanna say now because I always change my mind later anyways. I always change my, change my mind later anyway. So um, I grabbed some quartz so I can make a beacon so we don't get lost. But we're gonna have to head back to Silva. The base is silver. Make some graphing. Come back. You know, that's how it goes. But, um, yeah. If you guys enjoy, definitely leave a like. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe for some more. All right. So, first thing. Beacon. Time. Do I even have it unlocked? Doesn't look like it. Fantastic. How do I, why, why do I not have the beacon unlocked? That's like a basic item. A basic beacon item. That's exactly what it is. Where are you, beacon? Beacon. Perfect. Quartz, one. Good to go. Huh, there we go. All right, so I'm gonna start heading back to the shuttle. Yeah, I have no idea where that's actually at. I think it's... Uh, which way is it? Oh, no! I j Oh, now I'm lost. Oh, there it is. I found it. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're fine. So I'm gonna put the beacon down probably like on this hill. That way we can at least kind of see it from afar, hopefully. Hopefully from afar. But uh, yeah, we're gonna head back there. We're gonna head towards Silva. We're gonna go back, we're gonna make some graphing. We're gonna come back here. We're gonna go put the thing on the thing and do some things with the stuff and things and you know what I mean? It's just a whole uh, a whole thing, if you will. A whole thing, if you will. Uh, okay, that works. Perfect. So let's do that. <laughs> so I was playing with the scrap glitch a little bit because I wanted to get some ammonium <laughs> and I just realized how much better it gets. If you guys don't realize what's happening, yeah. Do you see how fast this is going? I'm going to tell you exactly why it's going so fast. <laughs> I didn't realize that worked like that. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm sorry. So uh, what I've been doing is for ammonium, like I said before, ammonium, I just I just scrap glitch, trade it off. It's good. It's fine. Because I, I don't really care. Like ammonium, I don't like getting it. I don't like getting it, but... <laughs> Uh, apparently the scrap glitch kind of stacks a little bit, um... And let me, let me give you an example of what I mean by, by that. So if you throw two items on here, I'm sorry, this wasn't supposed to be a scrap glitch thing at all, but it was, it's just too funny. <laughs> it's just too funny. Alright, so if you, uh, if you get your scrap on here, here's my batteries. And you throw one on here, you throw one on here, right? You see how fast it goes? That's that's the speed, right? It's it's quick, it's fast. However, if if you re-click these multiple multiple times like this, it thinks that there's way more on there than there is. And it gets to the point where it's ridiculous. So, if you just keep doing that, <laughs> it's it's too much. Oh no. <laughs> that's <laughs> I wasn't okay. I wasn't trying to to like completely exploit this, but good gosh, that's insane. That is insane. I didn't realize it stacked. It absolutely stacks. Okay. Anyways, so uh, we're gonna have a bunch of scrap here for a while. That's fine. Oh, I guess I had some money right here. Anyways, yeah. Well, um. So yeah, that is hilarious. I love it. It makes it so much better. Cause now, look at. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh, it's too funny. Okay, I'm sorry. 
So, um, yes, ammonium. I'm, I'm scrapping for the ammonium because I just don't like going to get it. I don't like going to get it, and that's fine. Because I'm not trying to do anything crazy. I've already beat the game, and I'm here to have fun. And I don't want to take an hour and a half to go find ammonium that I don't really have to go find. You know what I'm saying? You guys know what I'm saying? Absolutely. But that is hilarious. I did not realize it stacked like that. So I guess if you guys are still using it, if it's still a thing, uh, I don't know, maybe, maybe you want to do that. I don't know. I think it just allows for a... Uh, I mean, yeah, it's kind of cheaty, kind of cheaty, but at the same time, it also allows for a, um, a, you know, an experience that maybe you can choose to use when you want to. Again, I'm using it for ammonium because I just, I really, really do not like going and getting that stuff. I don't, I don't know why. It's a lot harder to find than it should be, but uh, we need hydrogen, so we're going to go ahead and get that guy getting up, getting made, doing this thing. We have a little bit here left, so I'm going to make a whole bunch of uh, hydrazine. Actually, I'm gonna make two, it looks like, because I only have two on there. Oh! There's hydrogen, there's hydrogen, okay. So it looks like I'm gonna make more. Fantastic. Absolutely fan- You know what, let's go ahead and cancel that for now. We don't really need it, so. Uh, I'm gonna make some hydrogen. And I need some graphite as well. I don't have any graphite on me. But we could always trade- Oh, actually, is this enough for- Yeah, we at least need two. We at least need two, but, um, hmm. Okay, do I even have can- I don't have canisters either. Wow, okay. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to find some resin, grab some soil, make some graphite. Again, like I said, I'm using the scrap glitch for ammonium and pretty much ammonium exclusively, just because I don't like finding it. Everything else is not too- not, it's, it's not too bad to get. But ammonium, I'm just like, nah, you know, that's that's one thing. I really miss the fuel condenser. I really liked it. It was a good time. It was fun. It's a shame it's not in the game anymore. If you guys don't know what I mean by the fuel condenser, there used to be a machine similar to like the uh, atmospheric condenser where all it took was power and it would make you hydrazine. So I missed that. I missed that machine because once you had power, you could get hydrazine super easy. Again, another reason that maybe I don't feel like it's super cheaty to use it for ammonia because there used to be a machine that did this anyways. And I was used to that. And they took my machine from me. It was terrible. It was a horrible disaster. Horrible disaster, but... <laughs> I didn't realize it worked the way... I didn't realize it worked quite that quickly. But anyways, let's go ahead. Let's get some things that we need. I'm going to grab two graphene, and this is always good to note if you're going to go out and grab... Uh, if you're if you're making the things for the, the core of the planet, always take two, because one activates it, and you're going to need the other one in order to take it to the satellite. So, always have to, if you can. If not, well, uh, then you just have to come back for it later. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is just too funny. That is too funny. All right, I'm gonna go dig up some soil now. All right, so the graphite is being made. I'm thinking it might be time for a quarry. I'm thinking it might be time to get a quarry going here because uh, this uh, this mineral extractor here is pretty handy. And I'm thinking a quarry might be, uh, might be coming soon for us. Maybe we'll do that in the next episode. Let's go. We're gonna focus on getting this core activated, and yeah, I think we're gonna focus on getting the core activated, and then maybe we'll see after that. I don't know. Maybe we'll go to Caldor, or maybe we'll go to uh, Glacio. No, we're not gonna go to Glacio right away. <laughs> Definitely not going to go to Glacio right away for sure. That place is uh, that place is a little sketchy. I'm just saying that place is a little sketchy. Easy to die. Easy to die. There's actually plants there that when you get close enough, they explode and kill you. It's great. In a horrible way. It's great in a horrible way. <laughs> if you guys didn't catch the live stream, definitely recommend it. But, um, okay, so we're doing this. I really need to get all this picked up. I need a bunch more resin. I mean, I guess I have two. We can make another storage deal real fast. We'll do that. All right, the scrap is nicely put away. I would say we have a little bit here that we... <laughs> Can definitely use for future things. Definitely use for future things. Okay, we're gonna take, uh, we'll take one canister of hydrazine with us so we can make sure our shuttle is good to go. I believe we still have uh, at least a canister and a half. Ooh, we're gonna be, yeah, good thing we have another. Where did it just go? Get, get back, get uh, hit back on the, on here. Thank you. Okay. All right, we're good now. So let's head back. We're gonna go back to Vesania. We are going to activate the core of the planet. If I could speak, that'd be great. Hey, look at now we only have one. Or we only have two. Ugh. It'd be nice if I could have uh, 
I guess I could have replaced it. I wonder what happens if you can... I wonder if you could do anything with like a half-used thing of hydrazine. I don't know, that's weird. But we're going to go back here, we're going to activate the corp, we're going to head to the satellite, we're going to put the thing on the satellite, we're going to activate that ring on the satellite, and then we're going to kind of figure out what we're going to do from there. I don't know what planet we're going to go to next, but we got to kind of do the same thing over again. I am going to go grab my RTGs because I'm not just leaving them there. That's for sure. We could go back and get more stuff to make more RTGs. I don't know, though. I don't know. I'm thinking a lot of batteries would be handy, though. If we just get uh, a bunch of storage things and make a whole bunch of batteries, we should be good. We should be good because those batteries actually worked really well and they're very condensed and compact. So each double slot actually gives us eight power instead of four, which is twice as much. So we might go that route. Ooh, I'm going to die before I get over there. I definitely need a filter. <laughs> definitely need a filter or two here. Actually, if I can get a couple, that'd probably be good because we're going to go to the core again. And I'm not going to have a tether line all the way down there. So we'll get a couple of these guys. And we should be good to go. All right, we're back. We are back. So we need enough oxygen to get ourselves there. But we also need, are going to need a bunch of batteries. I think I'm going to leave some resin here. I don't imagine we're going to need it. We already kind of have a pathway down there. I'm just going to have to find it. I'm just going to have to find the path that we got there with. So if we grab probably, I don't know, we'll grab four of them. I can always dump them if I need to. I would like to grab some astronium while we're down there. Get a little bit of he uh, head on that the bite curve, if you will. Actually, we'll grab a fourth. Yeah, we'll do four. Okay. That should be good. Hopefully, we don't die on our way down. That's probably more than likely going to happen, but it is what it is. We'll figure it out as we go. I like it. All right, so let's do this. Let's journey to the center of the core once again. To the planet's engine we go. Hopefully. And hopefully, we can get down there. I mean, most of the way should be okay. As long as we don't go too fast and fall. Okay. This is actually really fun. Where's where's the Mario music? We need that. Okay, there's the cave that I can't believe. I still can't believe we hit that as well as we did. Kind of crazy that we got that. Okay, we're good. And then... Where did things go bad? <laughs> I'm trying to remember. Oh, right here. That right there is where things went bad. Okay, so we fell down here. And we fell down here. And then... Oh! We actually weren't that far off, but you know what? We were going the wrong direction. We needed to be going that way. We need to be going right here. This is exactly where we needed to be going. This really type direction right here. I'm trying to make a, a, a mental note of that. Alright, cool. So then, pretty sure that's it. I'm pretty sure, wait, so if I follow this path, I should hit my tractor. Should, unless, did the tractor go down over here further? Maybe not, maybe it did, maybe not, I don't remember. But we are, we should be close, right? I don't feel like we're sliding very fast. Gravity's getting a little light. Yep, okay, it might be faster to run. Oh, gravity is way light. <laughs> All right, let's go. Come on, slide faster. Oh, the one time you wish you had gravity. All right, where are we going from here? Right here? Okay, cool. And we are at the core. I like it. Now, okay, so we went this way. This is where we about died. And then we went down right here. Perfect. All right, let's get this guy activated. Oh my gosh, I still absolutely love how this thing looks. It's absolutely insane. Like, tell me that is not cool. Tell me this is not cool. And we even blend in with our super amazing suit. I just love it so much. I love it so much. All oh, the lights, it's like the, it looks very Tron-like. And I'm a, I'm a huge fan of like the, the Tron style art and lines and you know, that kind of stuff, so. <laughs> but uh, all right, graphene. Whew, I was a little worried it wouldn't be graphene. Okay, there's one. And I will have another one, please. Hey, thank you. All right, look at that. 
Look at that. We can't even escape from here either, which is kind of funny. It's like, no, you, you can't actually leave until you activate it. Oh, we did it. We did it. We did it. It's amazing. All right, odd stone. Let's gaze upon it. Let's go to the satellite. Man, this stuff is so cool. I love it every time. Like I would cut, I would cut this out, but it's just, it's the coolest part, you know? All right, so, oh, we haven't done like any, cause that's the moon. Is that it? Okay, that's the right one. Uh, apparently we haven't done the moon yet. Or the moon of a say, wow, we've only done two? Oh, geez. We got a long way to get up. We got, we got a long way to go, people. Holy moly, I don't know. Uh, you know what, actually, this is a good time as ever. Would you guys prefer I keep playing this save or would you guys prefer me to switch over to my other save where we've already activated everything and we can do some more end end game kind of playing stuff. So let me know what you guys think. Base building, um, you know, base designs, things like that. So if you guys would prefer that, let me know. If you want me to keep on with this series, let me know as well. All right, so let's figure out which way we went. Because I, like I said, I want to grab some astronium. Was it this one? I don't know that it was this one, but I don't also have very much uh, oxygen left here. You know what? It doesn't actually even... Oh, I don't have my drill, though. I'm not probably going to be able to get any astrodium because I don't have a drill. Huh. Oh, wow. That one worked out very easily. Uh, I mean, I guess we have that one in this one. Okay, let's see. <laughs> we'll just try to get in... We'll try getting some astrodium. Oh, why is there no astronium over here, though? There's... Where's the astronium at? There was a ton of it at the other one. Oh. Well, where's... Where, where's the astronium? Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, there's a, there's a lot up here. Okay, let's try to do... I'm not gonna be able to dig in this at all, am I? Nope, okay, I guess we're going back to the core here. Is this the one that I came in on, by any chance? Doesn't look like it. Uh, Nope, not that one. All right, you know what? Doesn't look like we're getting any astronium today, boys and girls. No siree, we're not. We're not, we're heading back. I don't want to die down here. I don't want to do it again. I don't want to die again. <laughs> it's just no fun. Oh, the lighting is so cool. So we're gonna head back up to our activated gateway, which is right here. Thank goodness. Again, if you guys aren't going for the achievement of unlocking all of them, I recommend doing one. It's a lot easier. You know which one you went to. You know which one your base is next to, so that way when you teleport in, you don't have to worry about dying. Because that's the worst. It's the absolute worst. I also don't... Oh, is that... Actually, oh, hey, we can make a, a drill mod. Yay! All right, drill mod, perfect. And then let's actually go ahead and make a medium storage. I put you on here. Like I said, I want to get a whole bunch of batteries. Why? Why? Why do you do that? I want to get a whole bunch of batteries ready to go, so we can take them to the next planet, and we can just kind of use that route too. Oh no, my tractor has a whole bunch of batteries on it as well. <gasps> Poop. That's unfortunate. Maybe we should go save the tractor. Should we? Should we do that? A rescue mission for the tractor? I feel like we could. I should not have used all that resin though. Only problem is I could very well die in this rescue mission. I could very well not make it. All right, let's try it. Let's try it. We're, we're going for it. We're going for it. Because as long as I can find the tractor, if I can find the tractor, we'll be good. Because I have oxygen. And we'll be fine. So we'll try. All right, I feel like we're getting close. Oh, 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 there it is. We did it. We rescued the tractor. Oh, you're still here. And look at all my stuff is still here too. It's just itty bitty teeny tiny. Oh, it's amazing. It's amazing. Glorious days. A glorious days. Okay. So let's see here. What is of worth? That guy's only ceramic, lithium, canisters. Let's just grab the astronium. And everything else I really don't care a whole lot about. Uh, I will swap this canister out with this one. It's a little bit more full. Perfect. Oh, we actually found it. 
<laughs> I actually did it, guys. <gasps> guys, we did it. It's amazing. Okay. So now, <gasps> and it still works. It still works. Uh, I think what I'm gonna try to do now is I'm gonna try. What just happened? I'm gonna head back down and I'm going to try to realign and see if we can't be lucky and hit our cave again. And possibly just take our cave back up that we already have dug the first time, so. Uh, we shall try, see how well it works. Apparently not going very well. <laughs> but, uh, we found the tractor. Glorious days. You know, after the whole, uh, thanks Oppie thing and the, uh, rover, opportunity rover. We had we had to come back for this at least you know I just I felt too bad I felt guilty almost it's just like oh we're just gonna, we're just gonna leave it there we can't just leave it there can't just leave it there but we didn't we saved it we did it oh no way no way is this is this this is the one this is the one I was like okay you know what I I fell and I was like hey let's just we'll just uh, we'll just look around the cave. And see if I can't find- Yes! This is- This is it! This is the first one! Oh, that was easy. That was much easier. <laughs> that was- That was way easier! Oh my gosh, it was literally like around the corner! It was just- It was right around the river bend. <laughs> it was literally right here. That is wonderful. Oh, poop. Don't do this. Don't- No. 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 I refuse. I refuse. Okay, I need to I need to flip you really fast and get on and prevent you from doing anything crazy. Trailer, can you just flip and like go the other way? Okay, yeah, we're looking okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Now this now we're in a pickle here. Now we're in a pickle. Alright, we did it. We successfully turned ourselves around. We saved the rover. We grabbed the astronium. Like that is a win-win. I I feel like that is a win. What do you guys think? Save. We saved the tractor. Only to probably leave it here when we leave, anyways. But it's useful again. Yay! <laughs> it's useful again. So uh, yeah. The rover decided to do its thing where it decides not to work anymore. So I got on it and I uh, tried to drive it and it wouldn't drive. So it just decided to fall instead because I couldn't do anything to control it. Oh, that bug is obnoxious. Look at now we can't even do anything with it. Can't even do anything with the thing. Can we drive? No. How about now? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Come on. This bug has got to get fixed. I have never been so happy to see a line of tethers in my life. <laughs> Oh, we're finally back. We made it. The tether line signals the end is near. Or the beginning, depending on which way you look at it. Oh, we can even see the outside. This is great. Congratulations, tractor. You made it back out. I didn't think we were ever coming back for you, but the people, the people said they wanted you, so congratulations. <laughs> All right, so now that we have this guy back out of here. Oh, that was, that was simply the worst. That was, that was terrible. Let's be realistic. That was that was awful. Now that we have that guy out, let's go ahead and let's start loading this up with. You know, actually, why don't we just make a research chamber here and research this astronium here? Because there's really no point for us to take it back. And I have to grab lithium anyway, so we're gonna be here for just a little bit. I mean, nothing too super long and crazy, but I feel like it could be worth it to make. Do I even have? What do I need for a research chamber? Research chamber. One resin, two compound. Alright, where's the resin? And the compound. <laughs> and or the compound. Alright, compound resin, easy peasy. Making that happen. We'll probably just pull this guy off here for now. We're not gonna need you. And then we'll have the astronium start doing its thing. Um... Yeah, because like I said, I wanted to get probably... Hmm... A bunch. I want a bunch of batteries. I want like probably three. How many is that? Eight, 16, 24, 24 batteries and eight RTG power. So I mean, that's what? 32. That's 32, right? That should be enough to power everything. I would think. I would think it'd be enough to power everything. Uh, one Astronium. 
Perfect, look at that. Oh my goodness. Two and a half minutes, getting 400 bytes per minute. I like it. I like it. I can dig it. I can dig it. All right. So we don't need soil right now. Actually, I might need one. We're not gonna need you. We don't need you. We kind of probably need those. And I kind of need that too. Okay, all right, cool. I'm gonna go down, I'm gonna grab some lithium while that does its thing. And then hopefully we'll get a whole bunch of batteries and we'll head back. And that's actually probably gonna end the episode. So uh, yeah, we'll be back just a few seconds. All right, so uh, yeah, we got, <laughs> we got all the batteries. That was super, this, I got all these batteries from one deposit of lithium. Absolutely insane. You know what, I'm gonna go show you guys this deposit of lithium that I was taking out. There's still an absolute ton there, and it's right here, it's fantastic. So we got all those batteries. Now I believe, I believe that's going to be enough power to power any of the gateways. I believe, I could swap out one of the RTGs with another, um, like power bank, I guess you could call it, an another power bank. But uh, I don't, maybe we will, maybe we will. Actually, you know what, let me just grab enough to do another one. Like I said, I literally got all that lithium from this one deposit right here. It's crazy, there's just like so much of it. Uh, I was just digging out right here. It's so compact in here too, it's crazy. But I mean, you can see like we're getting lithium pretty, pretty quickly. In some areas you hit, there's like so many in one area. It's like we're getting absolutely crazy amounts of lithium here. <laughs> crazy amounts of lithium. But I think we will go ahead and make one more power bank, I guess. Just because I feel like it's, you know, why not? Might as well. We have the lithium. Let's do it. Let's do it. Um, I also got to pay attention to my auction. So what I've been doing is making a, uh, a filter. I've just been coming out here. I make a filter, then I run over here, grab that. There's a whole other thing of it right there, too. So, and yeah, absolutely crazy. It looks like it was actually mixed in with some aluminum as well. But yeah, definitely, definitely crazy stuff. So making one more battery bank and then we should be good to go. So as I'm looking around and I'm thinking about it, there's honestly no need for more than one RTG per base. Because if you had a, a setup like this, this one RTG right here is going to supply you with more than enough constant power to let you run everything off of it no problem problem because this guy's running and it's actually charging these slowly but once it stops these will charge fairly quickly so i mean honestly like if you just had a large power bank and the rtg to kind of supplement it when it's it's being drawn on i mean we have so much power with these guys right here it's insane um but yeah like oh my gosh there's so much power here i'm think i'm actually thinking about going to grab some more lithium and making a backpack full of batteries too because i mean like why not absolutely why not We'll take this guy back with us, load it up, and then I might as well have a batter, a backup, like a, a, um, a backpack full as well. I don't, I don't feel like there's any reason not to. And we can always leave these at the base, at like the main base place. Cause you know, I really, I like these better than the medium batteries. I'm not going to lie. I like these better than the medium batteries. They look pretty sweet and they have more power, and with how it's as easy as it is to get lithium now, there's really no reason to to use the bigger ones. The bigger ones are kind of cool because they're cheaper, they're more bang for your buck, but at the same time, if you want that extra high capacity power storage situational solution, then you might as well just hop on board and get go this route. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like, why not? Actually, you know what? Let's go look at this one. Let's go look at this one right here and see what kind of, uh, see how much lithium we can get off of this guy. Curious to see if it's gonna be as condensed as the other stuff. Now I am gonna be getting aluminum at the same time, so it's gonna seem like super crazy fast, but I'm just kinda curious how much lithium's actually here. I mean, there's a, a good amount. Definitely a good amount. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, good amount of lithium. For sure. Yeah, perfect, all right, cool. We're done, we're good to go. We're good to go. So yeah, playing it great for lithium. Holy moly. They should just call it lithamate lithamania. <laughs> lithamania. I know there's actually a country called Lithuania, but you know what I'm saying? It'd be cool. Alright, so we're good to go. I have 17,000 bytes. All the astronomy that we had is researched, done, good to go. We are going to take this platform with us because we're going to need it. So we'll go ahead and hook you. Right there, that's still powered. We'll just let you chill here. I like it. 
I like it. We're leaving everything here. You guys can stay here, hang out, have a good time. Uh, you guys don't party too hard while we're gone. Oh, shoot. I am going to need an oxygen solution until I get to the shuttle. I don't think I have enough to last. Maybe? I don't think so, because I'm going to have to do this whole hoppy thing. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have enough. We'll try. We'll try. We'll go for it. Yeah, we gotta be quick. Gotta be quick. Maybe we'll just grab some on the way. It's not like I don't have any power. Oh, geez. Stop. No. You're coming with me. Hopefully we'll find some on the way. <laughs> yeah, we might not make it. How terrible would it be if we died right here? It wouldn't be terrible at all because we respawned the shuttle, which is right next to us anyways. Um... Yeah, we're not gonna make that. Let's, uh, let's grab some of this resin real quick. Don't die. Yeah, we'll grab this resin. We'll be fine. Too bad I don't have a spot for it, though, in my bag. That's extremely unfortunate. Uh, gonna need you. Filters. Good. Alright, we're gonna have to leave one resin behind. Oh, shoot. We're gonna have to leave two resin behind. Actually, you know what? We'll leave that guy. One, uh, one of those is not worth... Actually, we'll leave this guy, too. There. Perfect. Looks good. Alright! We made it. We're good. Oh my gosh, that looks pretty sweet. <laughs> that looks pretty cool. Oh, that looks sweet. I like it. Uh, we just knocked over a spaceship. Okay, stop it. All right, we're good. We are good. Look at all of that. Oh my gosh, that's so much battery power. Let's head back to Silva, shall we? And we're back. All right, look at all of that amazing battery power. I love it. Absolutely love the amount of power storage that we have here it's absolutely great it's the best thing ever cool cool so uh next episode what we're gonna do in the next episode well we're going to head off to another planet power a, a purple thing and go to the core do the same thing all over again but now with all of these batteries with all this power that we have we will be able to uh power any any of them that we want so super handy why do you do that oh it's, i think it's because to make try to make sure it doesn't sink down below but um Super cool. Alrighty, guys. That's going to end it. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. We just, actually, we just passed 51,000 now. 51K. Insane. Absolutely insane. So, uh, yeah, definitely subscribe for some more, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!